guys, it's Chanel again, and today I'm back with a very early winter fashion haul for you all. I went to my favorite place in the whole entire world, Target. As you all know, I'm obsessed with them and got a few things. They're, they just put out the, all their fall fat, uh, their fall fashion, rewind. They just put out all their winter fashion, and so of course I go in there totally trying to get. What was I trying to get? I was going in there for honey. Yeah. And totally walked out with nothing but clothes and accessories and purses. So that's just how Target draws you in. So this is in no type of order. It's literally as I pull it out of the bag. But um, first off, I got some new jeans. You can never have too many, mostly for winter. And these are the new Levi ones. Are these Levi? Yes, these are Levi. Skinny jeans. And these are the like the new waistband ones where like you don't have to worry about like a belt because it cinches back in. So like it stays on your bottom. And I'm not like a big belt person, so to have a pair of jeans that stay on my butt without me having to worry about putting on a bulky belt to keep them up because even if I wore a belt you never see it because my tops go down over them <clears throat> then yeah I'm okay with that I love it and I also got them in gray as you all can see I have them on right now as well so I got those two pair of pants then this came out I'm guessing it's supposed to go along with their um, Christmas, New Year's party theme, but it's a clutch. But what draw me to it, not only is it gold, very, very pretty nice, but look, it's hold your iPhone. So you have this gorgeous gold clutch to go with any outfit that, of course, gold shoes, to put all your necessities in. Sorry. Like your wallet, um, like your money, your ID, and anything else you need. Maybe a lip gloss or something like that can fit in here. But right here in the slot where this white foam is, your iPhone will fit in there. And you don't even have to like worry about opening a person or something like that to answer it. You just are able to press what you need to press. Open it, talk. Yo, hello. Yeah, this party's hot. There you go. That's why I got it. I absolutely loved it. What I was absolutely in love with it. Um, this was twelve ninety nine, and you can get it in silver, um, a really pale pink silvery tone, and then of course the gold. And I'm sorry, my bad form. The jeans were seven twenty seven ninety nine. Very nice. Um, another accessory I got that I was obsessed with because <laughs> I saw it was this little mini black leather clutch. I just thought it was so cute. And I was like, well, now I'm getting a gold clutch. I kind of need a black one because I already have like a silver clutch. So it um, locks like that. And then you pull it open right here. And this is what went ahead and got me concerning getting it. It has this long gold chain like inside of it that of course is optional if you want to wear it or not but like that's just that sold me for the purse right there because who doesn't want something totally cute like that do like as a body crossover right there or just cute hanging down I know you can't see it but I want to just act like you can but yeah I just loved it because it was just totally cute and perfect for the holidays to go with a little cute dress and of course black pumps so, another holiday essential. Some other things I got was I indulged my scarf obsession some more. I don't know if I spoke much of it on it. I don't know if I spoke much about it on here. I know when I did my fall haul, I had like two scarves I showed you guys, but I bought like two more and I have like 20 in my drawer. Like, I have so many scarves you would think you would see me in a scarf every time you like I come on here. But in like reality, I don't wear them that often, but I collect them like it's not like, like that's straight my job. But um, they have a bunch of nice, pretty new holiday scarves out. They have a gold theme, silver theme, and then this really pink 
light pink to um taupey silvery tone um theme going on as well and this is the one of course from the gold theme section and it's black stripes with um gold stripes through it so can't wait to fully go out and rock this one with some really cute outfit or whatever but um really really cute i love just wearing scarves, mostly glittery ones to help dress up just regular t-shirts when you're feeling lazy but you want to look like you put a lot of effort in your outfit. I just grab a scarf and then I'm out the door. Um, here's another scarf. This is from the glittery pink section and um, this one is that um, nudish pink color with silver tone in it and I liked it because of the detail of the braid um waves through it i don't have a scarf like this in detail and then it has fringe at the bottom so totally cute can't wait to rock it it's going to be perfect for winter just the, the color is just going to pop beautifully love 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 and then of course these scarves both ran 14.99 and then la um second to last i got this rather thin sweater it's um it doesn't button up or anything like that it's just like a cami to throw over really really casual folds over kind of like that at the neckline really chill but um what drew me to it which you can't really see here is that it has like bronzy gold reflex thread through it i don't know if you can really see it in this light but it does just take my word for it, you can't see it. But um, it'd be perfect to pair up with like this scarf and just have like a little add of shine. It's not overpowering or anything like that. Like I said, you can't see it in the video, but mostly in your, when you're in fluorescent um, light, like indoors and things like that, it, it picks up really, really well. So it's just a really light cardigan loved it just couldn't say no to it and this was $24.99 and last but not least I went and got me some jewelry and it was this really cute gold um stoned gym necklace that just is just gonna pop like no other when it hits the light like crazy because I have like some really great cocktail dresses I haven't really worn much um so like I know I'm set for if a party comes up holiday party and things like that but I ha don't have like a nice choker the only choker necklace I have was that um one I showed you in my fall haul from forever 21 which was like oh um had green or blue in it like that real that pale green bl greenish blue in it with um the stones in it the um diamonds in it and that was it I didn't have like anything that could really play with multiple outfits so I finally got something that can play with multiple outfits that isn't overpowering but gorgeous and this originally retailed for $14.99 but because I am a savvy shopper and I found a like a fault in it I got it for ten fifty one. so before I end this video let me just give you my shopping tips for when you go out just anywhere like if you don't already know this you're gonna thank me do you know you can get 10% off marked down an item if you find a defect with it girl let me tell you boys out there too I do this with every out, like anything I pick up, I am staring it down. I look like some crazy person up in, up in the store. I'd be like looking at it, trying to find any little thing. Cause if I find just a slight chip in some paint, a slight tearing of a thread, I'm going to point it out to customer service and they'll throw that nice little sticker on there and reduce the price for you. Even though it's not on sale, just because there's something wrong with it <clears throat> because by law, they have to. That's just what they do. They they can't sell damaged mer merchandise. So if you point something out to them, they automatically give you 10% off. You just, you just have to point it out to them and they'll sh and see it. So instead of paying $15 for this, 
I paid ten fifty one, eleven, like totally worth it. And I did it with one of my scarves too. Yeah, both of them were, both of them were fourteen ninety nine, but I got the ten fifty one price on one of the scarves too because I complained about the gold one, which looks absolutely nice if you look at it. But I complained about um, there being some type of loose thread on the end of one of them and I was like well you know if I wash this you know the whole thing is just gonna fall apart so technically I mean it's not worth the price you're airing like pricing it for because it's technically damaged goods can I get 10% off and sure enough they gave it to me so I saved like straight almost six bucks right there so if you ever just take your time while you're in stores and if you notice uh, something's wrong with, so with something you're buying but you really still want it don't be afraid to go up to customer service and point it out. I do it all the time. Like, the time you, like, mostly, most people, this happens to everyone. The time you want to buy those really, really cute shoes, but you don't know if you want to really go ahead and get them because they have a slight scuff on them, on, like, the side or whatever, go ahead and get them at a cheaper price and go home and clean them up. Ta-da! It's not, it's not that hard, and it can really save you money and keep you from, like, paying full price on unnecessary things. And this gorgeous necklace is absolutely perfect, <laughs> other than I have to hunt for it, because I hunted for it, like, in the stores. Like, one of the gems in the necklace is slightly um, disfigured, where it's slightly cracked. If you can see that, right there. It's, it's a slight crack. It's something that no one's going to ever notice with their naked eye when I'm wearing this. <laughs> and... Pour it out to the cash register, cash cashier, and there you go. Save me some moolah. So, when you tight on money or you just want to save a little, keep a little in your pocket, don't worry. It's not bad at all to point out flaws on things that you're going to go ahead and buy and take home. But that's it for you all. Sorry for, did I turn a weird color with me going back and forth? Uh, I don't know. But... Sorry for the casual dress. Usually, you know, I try to come to y'all better looking. I just have no makeup on. Didn't even try to put my contact lenses on. I came straight from work, as you see. Not at all trying to protect my my pers my personal status or whatever. Showing off the school I work at. But, yeah, I came straight home from school. And <clears throat> was just like, hey, I'm going to put this video up for them. But I hope you guys are all doing well and taking care of yourself and are having just a blessed life and I hope you guys have a blessed weekend and I promise next video I'll come up here I'll put some makeup on and look halfway decent for you all but anyways you guys take care and I'll talk to you later bye <laughs>